What's up guys, Beyblade Ben here, and welcome back to another video. Today, I've got the Mega, or not the Mega Micros, that's something else. The This is the Beyblade Micros Battle Set. So yeah, if you get rid of that glare. Yep, Beyblade Micros Battle Set. So, just called a battle set, wow. Okay, so it includes Veltric V2, surprising this too, and the Micro form. And if you don't know what Beyblade Micros are, they're basically... Yes, base. They're basically just smaller versions of the full size base. They actually have like the same detail. It's actually pretty cool. So, yeah, Beyblade Micros. I got this as a Christmas present if you saw my video of what, everything I got for Christmas. So, nothing on the bottom it says one playset. Oh, wait, what? I thought there were two in here. What a ripoff. No. Yeah, I knew. So, yeah, Valtric V2. Surprisingly accurate. Surprising us too. Also surprisingly accurate, balance type, attack type. They don't really have types, but that's what it shows. There's them colliding, and on, t on, let's see. Yeah, the side and the top are just the same. Yep, there's the top, and there's the side. Okay, let's look at the back. The back real quick here. Say, Beyblade Mercus. It includes this giant stadium, two micro launchers. I already have, like, ten. And two tops. And these are... These are the, this is the only way to get confirmed micros tops because all the others are blind bags, which is really cool. I'm glad Hasbro finally did something in blind bags. Like, I hope they still do something more because we're in turbo. I'm like, please, but it's it's pretty obvious that that's not going to happen. So it says how you can exchange the parts, all the racist layers, and kind of tips, and they're really light. But I still think these things are really cool. So, yeah, let's get into it because there's not a lot to explain. There's not like any stats or anything. So, take my knife. I have a knife. Uh, uh, uh. Like, oh, what a nice dog. Look out, honey. He has a knife. What, what? No, no, I don't. Yeah, if you've seen that stuff movie, you know what that is. Okay. So, pry this open. And I do it upside down? I don't know yet. Okay, the bays plus their launchers are on these old packets, so that's nice. We add some cardboard around them. And sweet, this is right side up. As far as the bays and these cases weren't like just in here. But I guess that was to keep the stadium from bumping around in the box. Okay, it doesn't appear to be anything else. So the stadium is so tiny. I mean I knew it was going to be small, but I thought it was gonna be bigger than this. Like this stadium fits in my stadium, like a long shot. Like my hand takes up this whole thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick it up. I'm gr I'm actually gripping it right now, and I can just hold it. And these like tiny little pockets. Wow. Okay. Quick look at the instructions. Probably no different than the ones in the blind packs, except these are less folded up. Okay. Yeah. First to three points. Ring out. Finish and survivor finish. And doesn't appear to be anything different, really. So I suppose I can move this. Nah, I'm gonna keep it this way. Oh, if you look close, you might have gotten a face reveal. Eh, not a good one, though. Because it was not intentional. Okay. Let's start with... I'll start with surprising. So the colors on these are based off the ones in the Epic Rivals battle set, which is the first Hasbro battle set for Beyblade Burst, because they both have golden tips, which is what they were like in the battle set. Actually, is it? yeah, they did have golden tips. Surprising had a golden tip in its starter pack, too. Okay, so a launcher, and this is like my first straight Micros Ripcord, because all the others are bent terribly. I mean, I've straightened some out, but they're still not great. So now I have a straight one, but usually I just use the super grip launcher and I get a ton of power. Like the one for the, like the cord for the super grip, not the super grip itself. And I just get a ton of power on the battles are epic. So, Spryzen S2. Let's see, yep, you guys are looking at it right side up. So yeah, there's like the S. Starts up here, and, you know, just like an S shape. There's it upside down. Still has that S shape. So yeah, and there's like its face right there, and here and here where the screws would be in real life. I don't have a surprise in S2 I can show you guys. I never got that one, sadly. 
plan on maybe getting it soon because I've seen a store that has it. So obviously no QR code or anything. But yeah, looks nice. Looks really nice. Maybe one of the more detailed micros. I mean, none of them are very detailed. And the driver, I always try to find out what equivalent... Like, there's a big driver that's like the equi This driver is the equivalent of a bigger driver. There, I said it now, it makes sense. But this one appears to be fusion because it has a tiny bump on it. So let's do a test spin. Oops, I can't spin that left. My hand slipped. So yeah, it's just kind of sit there. And plus, this is a huge stadium. It's not meant to go in here. So that's nice. Obviously, they don't. These don't burst. They don't have a spring in them. I've had them burst a couple times, but they're not meant to. And plus, it's not like epic and parts flying everywhere. This kind of falls apart. Okay, next up is Valtriac V2. These are V2. This was Spresin S2, by the way, and this is Valtriac V2. They've done some of, like, the first gens. Like, they did Balder, Amaterios, and, like, Excalius. I guess it's Badarov. It's Badarov. Because I always call it Balder, but it's Badarov for Hasbro. Okay, so another straight launcher. It's very nice, and if you didn't know, you can take two of the launchers and put them together so you can have something that you can grip better. So that's, I really like how you can do that that way. You can make your launcher better instead of having to have the same one for like your entire Micros career. So let me separate these, and then I'll do that later because I can't get them now. Okay, so Valtriac V2. Victory Valtriac. So, wow, this actually has surprisingly good detail. Like, the wings are yellow, but there's like some... That's... Well, there's like yellow on the real thing, except on like these wings here. And there's like the warrior head. These are the yellow parts of the wings. These are also... Well, these are the... I'd say these are the... The yellow things are the blades. These are here... And a tiny one here and a tiny one here with the wings. But yeah, I really like this has really good detail. This has surprising detail. Wow. And the driver it oh I thought it was fusion for a second, but no. The I think this might look kinda orange to you guys, but I assure you it is gold. See so yeah, it kinda reminds me of spiral in a way. No, it reminds me of Jaggy. It reminds me of Jaggy a lot. But it's, I think it's just meant to be a very kind of a variable or like a plastic, like a plastic variable. So that looks nice. I like that. So let's have a spin in the giant stadium. Okay, we can't really get the full effect. So big stadium, good bat. Just like throw it across the room, and now we'll battle in this cute little stadium. Does it? Okay, this doesn't have a QR code for the app. I didn't think it would, but I thought it... Thought I better make sure. Okay, so there we go. Now I'll try test spinning it. It's so tiny. Now I'll try Sprezen. I figured while I was doing this video, I'd also try my other two micros that I explained in what I got for the holidays video. Balder and Unicrest... Or Batarov and Unicrest U2. So here's Batarov. You're getting a total reflection in the stadium. Here, that wasn't good. Yeah, you guys are getting a total reflection on my face. So look at my beautiful face. You can see it while it lasts. You can also see my ceiling fan. And here's Unicrest. This is a terrible quality video. I'm sorry. Okay, so yeah, now let's try. I'll separate the launchers here. If I can. There we go. Yeah, I won't get out the Super Grip Launcher rip cords, just because I want this. I don't want this to be an incredibly long battle, because that makes the battles pretty long. So here's Surprise, and I'll launch it first. And here is Valtriac. So we'll do a battle. Three, two, one, like rip. There's like not even room to launch the other. Like once you launch one, there's not even like room to launch the other one without landing on top of it. Let's try that again. Three, two, one, like that. 
He's so cute. They're so small. Oh man, big kids. And Preston actually wins. So I know it says you got three points, but I'm not. So there's a quick battle. I'll do more battles in the future. So I just got these two. I also got these two in blind bags from series two. Let me find my other micros. Ah, here we go. So yes, I have had micros, but I've never used them in a video. So I also have, let's see, okay, I'll do my series. So these are series two that I just got for Christmas. Quetzico is also series two. Excalius is also a series two, so I have half of series two because there's eight in each series. I have three series one because I have Kerbay SK2, Horus Suit H2, and Wyvern W2. And now I have Valtric V2 and Spryze in this too, which technically aren't from a series. So yeah, tell them, like if you got any recommended battles, let me know. But yeah, I'll do some more micro footage in the future now that I have an actual stadium. So yeah, thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time on my next Beyblade video. Stay hyped, you guys.